Curiosity is critical because I, I I'm insatiable for data and detail and people and issues and what they do around the world and what they do in different companies. And you learn from everybody. Sometimes it's like five people in the room who come up with the idea. It isn't that one person. And sometimes it's cumulative. It's a, little, a lot of little things and you got a breakthrough. And so I think people, when you sit in a room, you have to talk about everything. People have to read stuff and thought about stuff and thought before they come in. You know, a lot of people, you know, sometimes they just, they just strategize, but some people have really thought about what the competition is doing. Traveling around the world, you get some fabulous ideas. Every which way, whether it's a survey monkey, whether it's going to talking to customers of the branch, whether it's reading about it, was looking at customer complaints. Employees know a lot about what we're already doing wrong, so it's, you got to get it from all those various uh, people. What are you going to do? You're king for a day. What are you going to do? And it actually puts a lot of pressure on people to think hard and then collaborate before that. Like you know, I, I talk to a lot of people because I want to make a recommendation. I'm not just going to come in and admire the problem. Do you feel treated with respect? Do you feel treated equally? There's not a special club, there's not two classes of citizens, there's one class of citizen, we're all going to the right place, and, you, and being treated with respect means you can speak up. You can have ideas, you can speak up, uh, and every day you go to work, you feel good about when you walk in that front door.